Yes, it seems that Sweden is indeed an unusual, even extreme, country. A typical Swede has a very ambivalent relationship to the church. And I will then pour the water on his head for the mm. father, the son... Maybe we can just uh, skip uh, that part. Yeah. If you just can skip to say the words, Holy Ghost Jesus and, and Jesus. That. Yeah, I mean, we don't really believe in that. So you want to go straight to the hymn, then? Well, we were thinking about maybe you can play this song, uh, Don't You Worry, Child, with the Swedish House Mafia. Swedish families enjoy the most generous childcare benefit program in the world. Papaledic, Vareldar Bashakring, Vabbing. And you know, just as the Eskimos have a hundred words for snow, so the Swedes have a hundred expressions for parental leave. Come on, Winchik, where are you? Norway has invaded Sweden. I see, I see, but why are you calling me? I'm on paternity leave. No, 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 no. What's interesting is the Swedes are an extremely equal people. There are no hierarchies here. The Swedes prefer a so-called flat organization. Okay, attack on my command! Yes, Captain. That is if you feel like it. I mean, I don't have to decide everything all the time. You want to make a decision? Oh, maybe it's Ingrid's turn. Okay. Ingrid! Ingrid, do you want to attack? Do you want to attack? I think we should have a group discussion about this. That's a good idea. We should bring in Lasse. Yes. Lasse, yes. do you want to attack? It doesn't matter who you are, the same rules apply to everyone. We have three main concerns to discuss Someone with you. Someone forgot to put this coffee cup in the dishwasher. Oh, it says Fredrik on it. Maybe it's yours, Fredrik. But the dishwasher was full. So you empty it. Your mother doesn't work here, Mr. Prime Minister. OK, you have to excuse me. I, yeah. I must attend to this. Third time Sorry. this week? What if Angela Merkel comes yeah. and then there are no fresh coffee cups? She got the egg, she got the egg, she the, the, the combination of sexual liberation and the fear of conflict make the Swede hard to provoke. Look, my bike is messed up! Merde, I fought your mother! Oh, really? Oh, that, that's, uh, that's so good for her. She hadn't had much of a sex life. First, I thought you were angry with me, and now you come with this wonderful message. In many ways, the Swedish people are extremely tolerant towards minorities. Now, this becomes very relevant when you visit an ordinary football match. The Swedes are extremely independent and yet at the same time extremely tolerant. This odd combination leads to frustration. So, where do the Swedes go to let out their aggressions? Well, abroad. In your countries. <laughs> Extremely fascinating, isn't it? And yet we still only scratch the surface of this fascinating people.